How to add multiple textures in the same material with different UV maps without any extra geometry or modifiers. First, let's have an object. This one I got from the kit, which is free, and let me drop this icon on it. Open a shading window on the side, and we need to work on the color line, so import the image with a click and drop, then use a color mix between it and the main texture. Make sure it's on mix type, and plug the main texture on top, which is the A slot, then add your logo or icon in the B input. You can put the image on clip if you don't want it to repeat, but this object contains different parts, so we will fix that in the UV later. The image icon we used here has a transparent background, so we can connect the alpha from it to the mix factor. This way, the icon image will show at the top, and whatever transparent will reveal the main texture. The main problem we have here is that the two textures share the same UV map, since here in the settings, we have only one by default, and if we go to the UV editor to play with it, both of them get affected, and we need to add another one for each texture or icon. So add a new UV map, name it something nice, it will appear in the top UV bar. We also need to assign it to the icon's texture, and that's easy. Just add a UV node to the texture's vector and select the one you added. This way, we can modify the icon alone in the UV editor without affecting the main texture. This chest is made of different parts. We can select everything beside the area we need and move it away in the UV editor since we already put it on clip type. Another way to do something similar in nodes is with displacement maps. I did that on the door I showed you at the start. For me, it's dope to carve it on doors or walls with displacement, and you can watch that in the tutorial popping up right now, so enjoy. See you next time. Stay sharp. Goodbye.